of the uh, enormous spacecraft that, that fell from the sky. And, uh, Basically, right now, we're just looking for clues um, in this whole area to see if, if maybe... You guys seen Jeremy? Oops. Aliens? Any aliens? Nothing? No signs of... I don't think they've seen Jeremy. Fiberglass? Ooh, where's that? Is that what spaceships are made out of? We're looking for aliens. North? Do you have aliens in there? So what are you guys building in here? Is this where, is this where they whoa. store? We, we were told, whoa, whoa, what is this? That's heavy. This is something space-like. <laughs> Is this uh? What's all that hair on there? Well, is this is that? this spacecraft material? I don't know. Are you recording? Hey! What? It's Apparently, it's a touchy subject around here. He didn't want to talk to me. Cover up. Cover up. <laughs> it's a conspiracy, I tell you. No smoking matches. Or there was there was cow hair all in there. That sounds very suspicious. I think they're hiding something. Have you seen any cows around here? There's no cows around here, but there was cow hair in there. Let's continue our search. What is that, Jacob? Uh, I put my arm on the City of Roswell sign, and it burnt me. I think it's radioactive because of the aliens. I need you to get off that phone. We got aliens to find. All right. They can <laughs> trace you with that car. My friend Jacob's looking for a vehicle. I'm looking basically for like a 95 M class Star Cruiser, with probably like less than 12 parsecs. Some of the locals, and all I can say is it's been very, very suspicious behavior. Like they 
knows something that we don't. And uh, we're gonna investigate a little bit more into the matter and try to see if we can.